LSU won the national championship just two seasons ago, but the Tigers haven't been the same since. Head coach Ed Orgeron talked trash to the UCLA fans, not a good decision, when entering the Rose Bowl, but then his team went out and fell to Chip Kelly's Bruins by 11. Orgeron is now 5-6 and six since that title, and that's leading some people, Tony, to question his job security. Does Coach O deserve the heat he's already getting? So I'm not going to parse his words. I'm going to leave that for somebody else, but I'll parse his football team. Chip Kelly walked into the season at 11 and 21. As far as I'm concerned, and I know LSU had a bad year last year, to me, LSU should beat UCLA wherever they play. LSU is a football school. UCLA was a basketball school and a long time ago was a football school, but it has been a while, and they lost that game. In terms of whether Ed Orgeron should be feeling the heat, let me go to the glasses to get some records. When he has Joe Burrow with him, he's 25-3. and three. And when he has anybody else playing quarterback, he's 36-39. and 39. So what that tells me, Mike, is Ed Orgeron can be great if he's got a great guy playing quarterback. They gave up in the last, last year, in the first game of this year, they've given up 14 pass plays of 50 yards or more. That is the Bombs worst away, in D1. Baby. <laughs> the UCLA kid Bombs only completed away. nine passes. He got 260 and three. What are we talking about with LSU? Tone, you stated it perfectly. I'm going to leave that alone and go to UCLA. And, Tony, what's amazing to me is, and I know these, two, these are two huge victories for Chip Kelly, and he needs to be patted on the back and congratulated. N no buts when it comes to that. Now, but there's like a ch handful of people in the Rose Bowl to watch UCLA. They are the most fascinating team to me to start the season because I covered college yes. football yes. right after, you know, Terry Donahue, and part of the time he was still there, when he had that, as you could call it, whatever kind of school you want, football, basketball, whatever you want, UCLA was a national power in football for a while. And even when it wasn't yep. a national power, it was a threat to win the Pac-12 and get to the Rose Bowl. And now, Tony, they're in a situation with Chip Kelly, who was sort of coach owed, right? I mean, Chip Kelly dropped from the face of the earth after he had his own successful stint at Oregon, obviously. And now Chip Kelly's trying to pull UCLA back up. And you mentioned that record, start of the season 11-21. Now Bad. he's got these two Bad. wins, Tone. It's, it's, it's important they're, they're, to them. They're it's very nice to UCLA. Win. Let me go to Orgeron for a second, because he's born and raised in Louisiana, and he's beloved there. And everybody loves when he goes, go Tigers. Okay? <laughs> Les Miles was beloved when he was eating grass. Where is he now? <laughs> Gene Chiswick won a national championship at Auburn. Didn't take long to fire him. Gus Malzahn, didn't, Malzahn. in the national championship game, Auburn didn't take LSU, long to they'll fire him. Yeah. So they'll at, in the you. SEC, Mike, in the SEC, if you don't win, they're putting a for sale sign on your house. It's as simple yes. as that. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.